The average student pilot in North America spends $2,500 to $5,000 more than necessary because they show up unprepared. Hello everyone, my name is Steve, the Wired Flyer, and I break down aviation concepts in a simple to understand way, and I also document my journey from electrician to pilot at 30 years old. So we live in an amazing era where we have all the information we need at our fingertips to become a pilot without spending a dime. It's all free. All you need is internet access. In this video, I will be going over how to find what information you need to know to get your PPL. I will also be showing you different resources and places you can go to to learn all the information that you need. I will be providing links with real previous PPL exams that you can can study with. But first, let's talk about why it's so important to get the knowledge side of flight training done and out of the way, maybe even before you attend ground school and before you start flying. So ground school is where they cover all the stuff that you need to know to pass the PPL. They go over air law, weather, airmanship, flight theory, etc. And it's a great place to learn, but you could be learning all this stuff before you even go there. And I highly recommend that you try to gain as much knowledge as possible before you even attend ground school because there is an absolute enormous amount of information you need to know. It's commonly referred to as a fire hose of information. So it takes a lot of time to digest. So it's really nice to just start early and chip away one brick at a time, gain as much knowledge as possible. Because the hardest part for most students is not the flying. It's actually obtaining all this knowledge in a short amount of time. So by starting early, you'll be hitting flight school ready to go, and you'll be saving a ton of time of money in the air. Because flying is billed per hour, so a confused student is a very expensive lesson. Like why pay $250 an hour for an instructor to teach you something you could have studied on your own for free? So that's why personally, I think it's really good to get the knowledge stuff done first before you even start flying or before you attend ground school because it will save you a ton of time but more importantly, maybe a ton of money. Now let's go over some resources which give you an overview of all the information that you need to know. Now, if you're in Canada, you're gonna be going to the Transport Canada website. And if you're American, you will be going to the FAA website. Now I have provided links below to those two different websites, which provide study guides, which outline exactly what you need to know. And the Canadian version was a little bit better because it literally shows you how many questions are on the exam and how it's broken down. So it'll show you how many questions on air law there are and how many questions there are on general knowledge etc and an awesome thing on the canadian one is that it gives you little asterisks of the information that's very important to know that is guaranteed to be on the test so these are great places to start and kind of get a roadmap of the knowledge that you need to know now where do you go to actually gain the knowledge well there's many many different resources you can use and personally i went ahead and i actually bought the text that they recommend you buy when you go to ground school. And in Canada, the text they recommend is from the ground up. And if you're in America, they recommend the pilot's handbook of aeronautical information. Now I saw the pilot's handbook of aeronautical information for $10 used online. And you can buy this on Facebook Marketplace from the ground up. You can buy that on Facebook Marketplace for like 20 bucks. So I know that's not free, but there are free versions online and the FAA website, which I will have a link to this below, has the pilot's handbook of aeronautical information for free as a PDF. And the link will be below for that. And they also have PDFs on from the ground up, but I'm not going to provide a link because I'm not 100% sure they are legal as they're not on like the official government website. So personally, I don't really like just downloading the PDFs. I'd rather spend, you know, a couple bucks and get the book and be able to highlight stuff. And this has been absolutely amazing for me. And it's my Bible for aeronautical information. Pretty much everything you need to know will be in this book. Another great resource to find free information on the knowledge that you need to become a pilot is here on YouTube. And what I like to do is I like to read and take notes on chapters on here. And then I watch a couple of YouTube videos on it because sometimes when people explain things a little bit differently, it just clicks a lot better. Now, I will recommend three YouTubers that have helped me immensely through my journey so far. The first YouTube channel I'll share with you is 
free pilot training. Now, this guy is a certified flight instructor, and he is still making like weekly or biweekly videos on tons of concepts. And he has like a whole ground school pretty much on his YouTube channel. Definitely worth checking out. Another one of my favorite YouTube channels is Epic Flight Academy. Now, this guy, I find he explains the information even better, and it just clicks with me a bit better. And his style is more like an actual online ground school. Like if you go to ground school online, you will have to watch all these videos where instructors give you information rather than sitting in an actual classroom. And that's the style of video that this guy makes. I like the way he talks really slowly and he just does a really good job of explaining all the information you need to know. Another great YouTube channel is Flight Club. And these are more like animated style videos with voiceovers. So there's lots of really good images and stuff like that, but she does an amazing job of explaining the information on there as well. And the bonus channel I will share with you is my channel where I share everything I'm learning along the way because I want to become a CFI one day and I have a passion for teaching. So I'm trying to align all those together on this YouTube channel. Another great thing to do is practice actual exams. And you can do this very easily by simply Googling Canadian PPL practice exam or FAA PPL practice exams. And there's also links to practice exams in the description below. I was going through some today and they are awesome because these are real exams from the past. And although the new exams will be a little bit different, I would imagine a lot of the questions will be pretty much the same, just maybe phrased in different ways. There are also like workbooks that you can get. And this has been a really good one because I'm in Canada. Now getting the workbook associated with the text that you're reading could be super helpful because Sometimes like I think I have a really good understanding, but then I get asked a question in a certain way and I just can't provide the answer. So this does a really good job of just helping you do a deeper dive into the knowledge. So there you guys have it. You don't need to wait for ground school and you don't need to wait to save up a bunch of money to start flight training in order to gain the knowledge that you need to become a pilot. You can start today. All you need is some Wi-Fi and passion. So personally, as I intend to get my CPL one day, which could cost like $80,000, I am using this current time to save as much money as possible. But I'm not just sitting back and waiting. I'm actually trying to gain all the knowledge I can before I even get in the cockpit. So to continue learning and progressing on this journey with me, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. It really helps this channel out. I will continue making aviation content and documenting my journey from electrician to pilot at 30 years old. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you made it this far, please comment something that you would like me to make a video on. I am always interested in providing you guys with what you want and need. And don't forget, keep learning, stay motivated, and chase your dreams. Let's go.